Thank you for joining me. I'm Alex and I would like to talk about Delta Airlines. What they do will shock you. It's air travel, surprisingly. So current price is $57.66, which gives them market cap of $37 billion. Dividend yield is currently 2.7% with a 20% payout ratio, which is pretty good. Current revenue, $44 billion, which is up 7%. Earnings, $3.9 billion, which is up 10%. Um, that gives them a PE of 8, which in the grand scheme of things, like if you look at the whole market, a PE of 8 is amazing. Total assets, $60 billion. Total liabilities, $46 billion, which gives them a total stockholders' equity of $13.7 billion, which is slightly down. Um, obviously not a problem. So um, overall, you have to kind of look at, number one, what the market is doing. Number two, what the economy is doing. Those two are related, but not the same. And number three, there's plenty of other risk factors, um, global politics being a major one. There's obviously always the great threat of oil prices increasing and in terms their fuel cost increasing and so there's always a, a threat of their costs not being what's protected and you cannot really make make an estimate of what their fuel costs will be next year so um, there's many risks there and Many of them cannot be accurately predicted, but I think that there is more than enough uh, margin of error here to actually um, weather out pretty much any storm that there might be. So, PE of 8 is pretty amazing. Um, revenue is growing, earnings are growing, and um, there's stockholders' equity of $13 billion. Obviously, the balance sheet is not perfect, but it, it's pretty decent. So um, they're only paying out 20% of their earnings in dividends right now. So there is a huge margin there where they could be growing the dividends, they could be investing in the business, they could be um, putting money back for worse times. So... I think that there's enough margin here to actually work through whatever is coming and I think that for that reason this particular stock is reasonably safe. Obviously as I said in the Lufthansa video um, the demand for air travel is not diminishing anytime soon and it probably is increasing over the next decade. So. Uh, I would say that there is reasonable growth potential, obviously no huge growth, but reasonable growth potential here. And uh, for that reason, I think the whole sector is in demand and reasonably safe. So to sum that all up, obviously, if you're looking for a growth stock, this isn't it. But um, for a dividend investor, I think that there is pretty good dividend reasonable payout ratio and uh, the the payout ratio is so amazing that um, they could conceivably raise the dividend for many years to come without even getting close to their earnings or you know whatever threshold they have um, for a value investor I think the balance sheet is not great but I think that um, both the dividend yield, the payout ratio, and the earnings growth more than make up for that. So I think that for a value investor, this is also a pretty interesting stock to look into if you want to do that. Um, but even more so for a dividend investor, I think that a dividend yield of 2.7% is pretty good. And the payout ratio of 20.5% is amazing. So obviously do your own research but um, I would be comfortable with a reasonable position in this stock so that's it for me for today if you like this video make sure to subscribe I'm coming out with more videos every day before market open I hope you have a successful day